Hey team, I just wanted to give you an update. So we have this new camera. It has amazing video on it, uh, really easy to set up. So I just wanted to give you a little tutorial on how to use it. Um, that way it's just pick up the camera, do the, do the little things, and then you're ready to start shooting. Um, so first of all, first things first is the lens cap. You will pop off the lens cap and then up on the boom or little uh, shotgun mic on the back side, you will flip the switch to the middle. There's uh, three, it's three settings, off, on, and then low cut. Middle setting is great. Green light will come on. That'll just tell you that um, the mic is getting power. Uh, from there, you will, uh, right where you take normally take the pictures, there's the on-off switch. So you just flip that to on. Camera will fire up. Lens will throw out. Um, and what else? So you got the mic the turned on. Uh, you'll just want to make sure that your indicator dial, like your settings, is on auto. So there's green, a little line. You'll set that to auto, and it's really at that point all set to go. Uh, I like to flip up the screen so you can be looking at the camera. It could be recording you, and you can be able to see what the camera is seeing at that at that time. So I'll flip up the screen, move the little uh, cord out of the way, and it's set to go. Uh, if you want to take pictures, you just take pictures like normal. Or if you want to record this, like I'm recording this video now, there is where you hold the camera with your right thumb. There's a little red record button. And so you'll just hit that record button and it's set to go. You'll see your audio levels, that's good. Um, it's, it's a great camera. I think it's gonna be really easy for us to use. One of the things I've found is the shotgun mic sticks out a little too far, especially if you're filming out in windy conditions. You want to have what's called the dead cat, this big old fluffy uh, covering on that. You don't need that indoors. You just need the foam on the indoors. Uh, but if you're outdoors, it really helps with the wind noise, all that stuff. Uh, but what I have noticed is that you can start to see a little bit of fur in the picture. So I, I sometimes either pull off if I'm inside, I'll pull off that dead cat, or I'll just kind of fluff it to the side when I'm recording. Um, that should be it. Uh, one of the recommendations is get it all set up, make sure it's looking the right way. You can use the tripod or the little gorilla stand. Uh, gorilla stand's great on the desk. Um, set that up, get the right angle, and then press record and then just give yourself a couple seconds and then start speaking. If you're like holding it over here and recording it, it just adds a little awkwardness. Uh, so you record, talk into it, and then when you're done talking, you'll just stop, look at it, you can smile at the camera, and then at that point you can go turn it off. So hope this helps. As always, reach out, let me know if you have any questions, how to use it. Um, I think it's gonna be a great tool for our team and for our church and looking forward to putting it to use. Cool.